Yesterday, presidential hopeful Bernie Sanders was in Vancouver, so that had us wondering why Vancouver. Our Cole Miller found out what makes it the most recent political pit stop, Cole. Well, Jennifer, it really has to do with location. At least that's what a political analyst tells me. He says it's a unique location and that it's very possible we could see the Republican field heading this way down the road. First, it was Bernie. All I can say is whoa. And today, a familiar face and former president. Hello. Bill. Hello, Vancouver. Both stopping by a day apart, sparking excitement in the city. Just enjoy it. It's rare that we get this kind of national attention, so just enjoy it. That's political analyst and Pacific University professor Jim Moore. Yeah, it's an exciting time. But just why did they pick Vancouver? There's two big reasons. Moore says, first of all, it's the people who made up these crowds. It is a population center in Washington state. And secondly, it sits in a unique spot given the state's makeup and media coverage. Oregon, because Oregon's here, Oregon media covers it, Oregon's primary is coming up in two months. So it gets Oregon voters jazzed as well. Thank you and God bless you. Neither Sanders or Clinton fine-tuned their message specific to those who came out, and Moore says that's not uncommon. But the race in Washington state and Oregon, he says, comes down to this. In the Pacific Northwest, as in a lot of places, people are not as enthusiastic about Hillary Clinton as they are about Bernie Sanders. She's got the votes, but the enthusiasm gap is, is big. So what about these guys, the Republicans? Should we expect to see more secret service in our backyard? The short answer is yes. Here's the elaborated answer. It'll especially be in Oregon, and it'll be because, of, because Trump will not have put this away. There's a lot of computer models out there. The earliest Trump puts away the nomination is going to be two weeks after Oregon. And as you heard Moore say there, Oregon's primary, it's coming up in just two months on May 17th. We'll be sure to be covering that one. Jennifer? Of course, folks, better get ready. Thanks, Cole. And looking